Welcome back, boys and girls. And the title of today's story is Sneezy the Snowman, written by Maureen Wright and illustrated by Stephen Gilpin. Boys and girls, are you ready? Well, let's go. Sneezy the Snowman shivered. Brrr, it's cold out here, that's for sure. I need a drink to warm me up. So... He drank cocoa from a cup. He said with a smile, I like this a lot. And then right there, believe it or not, he melted from drinking something too hot. <gasps> the children cried out, what should we do? A voice from the puddle said, make me brand new. Oh my goodness, boys and girls, look what happened to Sneezy. They rebuilt Sneezy as snowflakes flew. A cold winter wind swirled and blew. The snowman sneezed a gigantic achoo! I'm sneezing and freezing and shivering too. A little girl said, then let's share. I have something you can wear. Here's my hat to put on your head. You look awesome, the children said. The snowman blinked his cool black eyes. The stocking cap was a nice surprise. But Sneezy the snowman shivered. Brrr, it's cold out here, that's for sure. I am freezing every minute. I'll find a hot tub and sit right in it. He found one and smiled. I like this a lot. And then, right there, believe it or not. Oh my goodness, boys and girls, what do you think is going to happen now? <gasps> Let's read to find out. <gasps> he melted from sitting in water too hot. The children cried out, what should we do? A voice from the hot tub said, Make me brand new. They rebuilt Sneezy as snowflakes flew. A cold winter wind swirled and blew. The snowman sneezed a gigantic achoo. I'm sneezing and freezing and shivering too. A little boy said, then let's share. I have something you can wear. Here's my scarf that's red and blue. I think it would look great on you. Ugh, what a good boy. I love the way they share. The snowman blinked his coal black eyes. The colorful scarf was a nice surprise. It went very well with the long pink hat. The children all said, how about that? But Sneezy the snowman shivered. Brrr, it's cold out here, that's for sure. I need to find some warmth on me. There's a campfire by that tree. Uh-oh, here we go again, boys and girls. I don't think that's a good idea. What do you think? Hmm. <gasps> he said with a smile, I like it a lot. And then right there, believe it or not, he melted from standing beside something hot. The children cried out, what should we do? A voice from the puddle said, Make me brand new. They rebuilt Sneezy as snowflakes flew. A cold winter wind swirled and blew. The snowman sneezed a gigantic achoo. I'm sneezing and freezing and shivering too. A little girl said, then let's share. I have something you can wear. Here's my coat, the perfect fit. I know that you'll look good in it. Oh, she's so cute. 
the snowman blinked his coal black eyes. The bright orange coat was a nice surprise. It went very well with the scarf and hat. The children all said, How about that? Oh, boys and girls, look at the little girl shivering because she gave her coat to Sneezy. I mean, what a good friend. Ugh. But Sneezy said, Woof, I'm way too hot. I'll take off the new clothes I've got. <laughs> Sneezy cannot make up his mind, boys and girls. The children yelled, no, that's not the way. Listen to what we have to say. Buy something cold at the ice cream store. Have two scoops or three or four. Sneezy ate ice cream seven scoops high. This is great, the snowman cried. I'm not too cold and I'm not too hot. And I'm wearing clothes I like a lot. Then after eating every bite, he said at last, I feel just right. <laughs> and of course you do. <laughs> the end. Oh, what a great story, boys and girls. Isn't Sneezy so lucky to have great friends like that, boys and girls? I hope that you are a good friend also, boys and girls. Be kind always. And thank you so much for reading with me again. And I will see you again real soon. Bye-bye. Please like and subscribe.